Hello everyone. We will continue the topic string comparison operators. And in the previous video, we started with the string comparison operator NP that is contains no pattern. We did a few practicals and we will continue rest of the practicals. And we will go for same to same scenarios which we covered during CP. Now we will cover for NP. And in the last video, we started with escape character hash and we used escape character hash for the case sensitive search. Now we will continue from there itself. Now, what is the second use of hash that is escape character? With the help of hash, you can search for wildcard characters star and plus also. Now, why, why I am specifically writing star and plus? Simple. Because if you are putting star, but SAP understand that you are going for sequence of characters. But now we are not going for sequence of character. I do not want to search for sequence of character. I want to search for single character that is star, star. I want to look for single character. I want to look for single character plus because star means it is sequence of character. Plus means it is used to match any single character. But I want to look for specific star. I want to look for specific plus. I want to look for specific hash itself. Then in that is how, how you will do that. Now in that is how I will do. Suppose how I will write. Suppose star. Star means sequence of characters. After that, I will put hash. Now firstly, suppose I will go for star. And then again, I will put star. Just see how it will work. This first star will act as a sequence of character. Now, this second star will not act as a sequence of character. This second star will treat as a character star only, single character star only, because before that we have hash. And whenever you are putting hash, well, it means after that, whatever the character is there, SAP will interpret as it is. Now, this star will again treat as sequence of character. Now, just see, its first string is containing the pattern of second string. The answer is no. Just see, star, star means sequence of character. Hash, and then we have star. Now this star is not sequence of character. It is a character star itself. Now your first string has the character star. No, we do not have star. Then this star is again sequence of character. So first string is not containing the pattern of second string. And we are looking for contains no pattern only. So we will get a true result. So if I will show you in that debugging mode, we will get the clarity. I will activate. So whenever you want to treat or whenever you want to look for specific character, hash, star, plus, you need to use hash before that. Otherwise, SAP will treat for different meaning itself. Now, if I will show you in that debugging mode, I will go to desktop 3, most preferable desktop. So we have, this is the first string. This is the second string. Is first string has the pattern of second string? No. And we are looking for that only. Now you can see this if condition is true. And whenever we have the true result, it will return the length of the first string. It will return the length of the first string. And what is the length of first string? 30. Now, in which scenario it will give us the false result? Contains no pattern will give us the false result. 
Now I will simply, simply write here, suppose star. Now we will see. Now we will get a false result. Now is your first string has the pattern of second string? Yes, it has. Star means sequence of character. Hash star, it means it will look for this character star. Yes, it has the character star. Then again, we have the sequence of characters. Yes. So now it is containing the pattern. First string is containing the pattern of the second string. But we are looking for contains no pattern. So it means system will go for which part? Else part. Now if I will show you in that debugging mode. I will go to desktop 3. Most preferable desktop. Now, this is our first string and this is our second string. Now, system will go to else part. And whenever this is false, it is returning the offset or position of the first matching character. Just see, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, we got the star at the sixth position. Same way. If I want to go for plus, same to same way, we can go for plus also. Because this, if we are simply writing plus, plus means it is matching any single character. But now we are not matching any single character with the help of plus. We are looking for plus only. So suppose if I will go for plus. Now suppose I am going this. I am going like this and now here if I am putting plus. Now is first string has the pattern of the second string. First string do not have the pattern of the second string because star means what sequence of character. Now first this plus will treat as plus character only. Now it will not match any single character. Is your first string has plus? No, it do not have plus. Then star is again, again, we have sequence of character. So now this if condition is true, true, because first string do not have the pattern of the second string. So whenever we will get a true result, it will return the length of the first string. So we will get the result 30. You can see we got the result 30. Now, if I will put plus here. Now, we will go for activate. Now, is first string has the pattern of second string? Yes, it has. Star means sequence of character. Now, plus. Yes, we have plus. Then star, again, sequence of character. If I will look for this, I, I will show you in that debugging mode. Intentionally, I put plus little bit here so that we can understand the position more better. I will go to desktop 3, most preferable desktop. Our first string, second string. Now, first string has the pattern of second string. But we are looking for no pattern. So, system will go to else part. Whenever system will go to else part, it will return the offset or position of first matching character. Just see how it will be. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Plus is at 18th position. So we got that true result. Now, similarly, if you are simply, simply writing hash SAP will interpret the next character. Now, if I want to look for character hash only, then in that case, how it will be? I will simply simply put hash here. Now, in first, in first scenario, we will get a false result. We'll get a true result, sorry, because we are looking for no pattern. Now, this first string has the pattern of the second string. 
first string do not have the pattern of second string. Suppose star sequence of character. After hash, now this will treat as a hash character. Is your string has a hash? No, it does not have. Then star in sequence of character. So first string do not have the pattern of the second string. So we will simply, simply get the length of the string one. This if condition true. And we will get the result 30. Now suppose if I am going for hash. Suppose I will put hash now here. So that we can understand the length more better. Now is first string has the pattern of second string? Yes. Star sequence of character. Then do you have a character hash? Yes. Then you have again sequence of character. So we will get a, in this case, we will get a system will go to else part because first string is containing the pattern of the second string. But we are looking for contains no pattern. I will go to desktop 3, most preferable desktop. This is our first string and this is our second string. And system will simply, simply go to else part. Whenever it will go to else part, it will return the offset or position of first matching character. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So hash is at 11. So what is the summary of this particular video? In this video, we covered rest of the practical part of string comparison operator, no pattern. And we simply, simply cover this star plus and hash. Now we are not going for star as sequence of character, hash as interpret the next character plus to go for matching any single character. We want to look for these as characters only. We do not go for different meanings of this character. In that case, you need to use hash and you can pass that particular character. So that's it in this particular video. Thank you.